Welcome to our podcast, where we cover interesting and fascinating stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss fetuses absorb microplastics, retain them after birth. In a new study, an alarming claim has been made about microplastics being present in the lungs, hearts and brains of newborns. In a new study carried out by researchers from Rutgers University, it was observed that after newborn mice were exposed to polyamide 12, or PA-12, through inhalation, after this tiny plastic pieces were found inside their lungs, hearts, livers, kidneys, and brains. In the research, it was seen that microplastics can pass through the placenta during pregnancy and can even expose the developing fetus. Scientists did not rule out the possibility of fragments passing through the mother's milk after the child's birth. However, the presence of microplastics at such an early stage of life was alarming. Nobody wants plastic in their liver, said Phoebe Stapleton, who is an associate professor of pharmacology and toxicology at Rutgers University. Now that we know it's there, as well as in other organs, the next step is to understand why and what that means, she added. Microplastic pollutants have already been linked to an increased risk of cardiovascular disease. However, researchers are now worried about the long-term implications of this MNP exposure. As per the report, exposure to pollutants and chemicals at an early stage of life will increase the risk of health problems and chronic illnesses. These results raise concerns for the toxicological impacts associated with MNP's exposure, maternal fetal health, and systemic MNP's particle deposition, wrote the researchers in their published paper. I don't think we'll ever get rid of plastics altogether. They're too important for modern life, said Stapleton. But I do think we might get to a point where we'll have some policies to indicate which ones are less toxic than others, he added. We have many more such compelling episodes for you. Enjoy them. Do share your opinion in the comment box and subscribe to us for more.